Hey, what's going on? It's Coach Donald with Low Heat Performance. I wanted to send you a quick, fun workout you could do right now while you're at home. All right? Give yourself a few seconds, get the family together, get whoever's at your house together. Maybe just kind of give yourself a pause for a second, pause what you're doing, and just knock out this quick workout. Here's what we got. We're going to do 100 push-ups, 100 split squats, and if you need to do regular squats, you could do regular squats. We'll go with 100 V-sits, and then we will also do 10 10-second 10 hollow holds uh, face down, or Superman's holds, as some of you may call them. All right, hit, the, hit pause real quick. If you need to pause and get things together, pause a couple other things going on, and then we're going to come back into the video. And here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm actually going to do it too, so you can do it along with me, right? Here we go. I don't like to work out with my glasses on. Good start there, good start there. You can do your V sits with your hands down, you can do hands off the ground. Hopefully, you've had a good day. I have. I woke up feeling under the weather, a little cold. Um, and so, doing a lot of home workout, just trying to stay away from people. Nonetheless, no reason not to continue to do what we got to do. So as you notice, I'm just doing these in four rounds. So four rounds of 25 of the push-ups, four rounds, 25 of the V-sits, and then three of those 10 second rounds. And then we'll go 25 split squats. 25, left leg, come back next round, do right leg in front, and then do that again. Hopefully you've been having a good day so far. I went to the grocery store yesterday and like everything I bought out. I tried to buy for like a couple weeks. Oh uh, man, I lost count. And um, hoping that things kind of pass for the end of the month, but also not really you know, knowing the whole restock timeline of grocery stores. All right, I think that's like 25. So, trying to stay, you know, prepared for all that. So, got some extra food, but I, I don't like consume too, too much. So, uh, hopefully, you know, you're staying safe and having good quality time since you may be at home a little bit more than usual. There we go. Knocking out that second round. How you holding up so far? 
Hope you are getting it in. Might bring a little sweat. Breathing might pick up a little bit. It's all right, it's all right. Exercise is medicine. So yeah, you might be able to my voice. It's a little bit hoarse. I um started feeling under the weather Thursday and ended up having to take Thursday off and then work through Friday, but then ended up taking today off because I started feeling under the weather again. And realizing that, well, this is really bad timing given everything going on. Um, we got to make sure we get our sleep, right? And when we don't get our sleep, you know, things we don't want to happen start to happen. And that's what this is now. So, stayed in the house, did some reading, some meditating, thinking. Went for a nice little hour walk, <clears throat> getting some fresh air. Halfway through, told you this won't take too long. Um, and we're getting ready for that second half. Check it out a little bit. Make sure you get a little stretching in when you're all done. Never underestimate putting it in, you know, getting it in for 10, 15 minutes while you're at home. <clears throat> Shout out to Gwen, I just finished this trilogy that you may have, many of you may have heard me rumbling about. It's some, it's like slightly called the Three Body Trilogy because of the flagship first book, The Three Body Problem. Hold on. This is Chinese science fiction thriller. I'll spare you all the details, but I just finished the third book last night. And oh, wow. It's always good when you find those like stories, whether it's like a book, movie, TV series, that has this really unpredictable, but believable, but still wild series of events. Pretty insane. I remember when I was a kid, I would read the Misadvent, what is it called? The Series of Unfortunate Events by Lemony Snicket about those orphan kids whose like rich parents died and they were like doing all these wild things. Came out when I was a kid. I really want to like go back and reread all those. But this was kind of like that. Oh yeah. Sometimes we gotta just break out that workout on a Saturday evening. Although sometimes it stems from a tradition, times with my friend Kadir, where we would like work out before going out. Well, I'm not going anywhere tonight. Like my party's here.
Now for that last round, you might have felt those ones a little bit. It's all good, it's all good. Here we go for that last round. See how you fly through this. And then get back to your regular scheduled programming. So I have this um this T, right? Ah, I still can't sit back long like that. Um this licorice root tea. When I say this is some good tea, some good tea. Marcel put me on this, and uh, I went and bought some more yesterday. Now, I need to research a little more about licorice root. And I need to understand why it uh, says that you shouldn't drink it daily for more than a month, three, four weeks. So I'll look that up. If you have any insight on that, let me know. But this stuff tastes really good. And I would love to drink it pretty much every day of my life. Um, told uh, Asia, this uh, high school uh, high school girl, we were training for triple jump, and I told her this, and she was like, licorice root. I'm like, child, you don't even know what you're missing. Oh my gosh. Shout out if you've ever had licorice root tea before. Although, funny thing is, I haven't had actual licorice since I was a mere child. All right, we got last round. Bring it on home. Here we go, last two exercises. Going great. <clears throat> Make sure when you do these, you know, it's a little late to say this, Keep that tension back there. All right. Let's take this one home. Knock out these last 25 split squats. Yes. Great job, great job. A little stress. I need to do this real quick. Help you feel a little better. Sometimes getting that quick workout in, break up the day, can really make you feel good and refreshed for that moment and make sure that you have a better day. Um, if you're watching this Saturday night, we're still going to do our run tomorrow. Uh, we'll be out in the open air, right at the entrance to Sony Park, uh, by uh, the Burhill Trail, on Greenwood, Greenfield, and Overlook. So that's where I'll be at. You'll see my non-missable Volkswagen Jetta. Hope you have fun with this. Get back to your day. Stay safe. Enjoy your time being with your family, being at home. Um, embrace it. Stay safe. Make sure you keep those hands clean. And 
out. We'll still be at it next week. So, see you in.